she would say that I, I ruined her life, and she would explain to me why and how I ruined her life. If she wasn't in a tantrum and she was just speaking normally, she would just explain all the things that she could have been, an actress, broadcasting. I learned about her aspirations with disappointments with not being a child actress and wanting to go on acting or uh, broadcasting. She told me that she had a job in New York to be a hostess at a restaurant, that she said she could make almost 50000 a year, and that then suddenly she had gotten pregnant, that she had not wanted to get pregnant, that my dad gave her an ultimatum, either you leave or you stay home with my son and quit. So she chose to stay home and essentially her life was pretty much ruined from that point on. But then we would have more discussions about how much money was being spent on my tennis, all my dad's time out on my tennis, who cares? And then I would hear about the lessons she couldn't have, the things that she couldn't have. Um, and then there would be other times when she was in a tantrum, and then it would just come out very, uh, you know, in a rage. She would be throwing things and, and, and screaming and flailing and wanting and trying to hit you and saying that you're a bastard. She cursed a lot. And uh, wait till your dad gets home, I'll tell him the things that you didn't do today. And uh, I wish you were never born. And why can't you be like your brother? And what's the matter with you? And, and then I would try to say something. She would say, shut up. I don't want to hear it. You're stupid. I hate you. How old were you when you heard things like, I wish you were never born? Seven.